Hey, I'm Chris Dancy, and I spend a lot of time at conferences. And if you're like me, and you work with conferences, you're a conference organizer, you're an actual venue, or a service provider doing facilities, AV, or even speaking, do I have something exciting to show for you? I have been working on something with my friend, Caitlin Carey, called Pop Event. What is Pop Event? You know as well as I do, it is really difficult to find any sort of help when you're planning a conference or doing one. Usually you have to rely on Google searches or a friend of a friend who might know something. What facilities are the best? What organizers have your specific skills? But more importantly, if you're a service provider, how do you get found? Pop Event is here to solve all of that. We have so many great features in this and I'm gonna show them all to you today, starting right now. To get started, we have to think about what we are doing. As conference professionals, we spend a lot of time planning, executing, and organizing, and just hoping that all the decisions we've made right are correct. But what happens if they're not? What happens if we bet everything on one venue, or bet everything on one speaker, or AV company, or food company, and they just didn't do it for us? We need a directory that helps us filter down by review, by location, or by focus, the three main things we need when planning an event. And that's exactly what Pop Event does. Let's get started. At its heart, Pop Event is by organizers for organizers. So let's look at the tool today. If we come in here, the very first thing we see is a join now, so you can go ahead and sign up. But more importantly, you come right into our robust directory. Pop Event is founded on a directory of thousands of event professionals in the Northeast. And from there, we crafted the solution. So first things first, if you're an event organizer and you're looking for another organizer to collaborate with or find some special skills, we have an organizer directory focused by region. So when you list yourself, right away you can be found in the region you are or prefer to work in. Some of us don't wanna travel across the country. The next thing is, what's your organizer focus? Maybe you wanna come in and find someone who just specifically focuses on technology or someone who has an, a, a particular focus on executive retreats. Our organizer directory makes it super simple for you to get listed and get found. Most importantly, we didn't stop there because organizers finding other organizers or events finding organizers to help them is just the start when planning an event. You also need more help. Let's look at that second customer we address right now. Just like organizers, services are super important to a venue. And with those, if you're a service provider, you can list yourself or search for a service. Again, by region, where are you in the country? A lot of times you want someone local. Hands-on is super important, but more importantly, service specialty. Are you an AV company, catering, entertainment, music, lighting, promo items, like me, a speaker? Finding services for your event that's targeted by and for organizers is so essential because we work with the best and we always recognize the best. I personally have had a few conferences myself that I have organized over the last three years, and it's been incredibly difficult to find trustworthy service providers that will come in and do the job they were told to. But we didn't stop with just organizers and service providers. We went to probably what some people would consider the most important layer of search and directory for event planning, the venues. But there are a million directories for venues on the internet. If you look up event space, you have all sorts of filtering and, and stopping and, and connecting, but like they don't really give you what you need. Yeah, you can sort by capacity, but again, sometimes you want to know a specific location. But we did something different with ours. We actually created a venue vibe filtering. And that means your venue can list itself with its vibe. Sometimes we don't want a specific space or a specific capacity. We want a feeling. And feelings are what really drive events nowadays. Our vibe search allows you to list your facility by vibe, or if you're looking for a facility, search by vibe. And this has just radically changed how we do and plan events. Now that we've got the basics for what the POP events directory can do, let's look at how we use it a little bit more. And for that, we're gonna look at two exciting features. Each one of our customers, whether they be free or pro, have a difference in how they show up in our directory. And we're gonna look at that right now. Getting listed is super easy and it's free to do today. 
We even have special programs for our friends and family to get them signed up quickly. But what's the difference between a free account and a pro account? Let's look at organizers. If you're an organizer like me and you wanna get listed and hired for your skills, why would you spend $100 a year with Pop Event versus doing it free on a Wix account? First, Wix looks kinda cringy. But secondly, the difference with us is so clear. First, you don't wanna manage an entire website, you wanna manage your business. So in our directory, we give you the ability to list yourself, your tagline, your main website so we can drive people to it for conversion and you can even put a wrapper on that and measure how many leads you're getting. Then you get your specific region and what you do. You get to even post a photo and a logo. For our paid accounts, it's really great. Just like the regular accounts, you get your tagline, your name, your logo, but with our paid accounts, you get things like your social media, you can add a button to Stripe for paid consults. You can actually put your focus. Maybe you specialize in trade shows or incentive or even your industry tech. You can put in your keynote logos, like all your big customers you've ever worked with, and then upload an entire multimedia program of some of your best work you've ever done. So the difference between getting yourself listed on the free or pro is really clear. Additionally, if you're a pro user, you get your own URL. So popevent.co slash, in this case, Caitlin Carey. It's wonderful, easy, and it's really fun to remember. And it's run by trusted organizers and people all over the events industry. Just like organizers, event service providers, me now wearing my speaker hat, it's hard to get found. You could be a speaker, and again, you could have a website and do all the SEO, but at the end of the day, referrals are what matters. People re recommending you are how you get found in this business. Most of my business as a speaker comes from repeat of clients and clients who referred me on to someone else. Our free and pro offering services are structured just like our organizers. Our free, you can come in and list yourself, list your business, your tagline, some photos, a little bit about you, and it's all right there. But our pro allows you to come in, add videos, bios, complete uh, uh, galleries of photos. Mine looks just as good as my website. There's my bio, my name, some of the keynotes I do, some of the other services I offer like experiences, a short promo video for me. And I even can list my bio of services, which has a pricing guide in it. This is important because when you're planning an event, you need answers quick from people you trust. And that's what pop event is all about. It's for organizers by organizers. Let's look at our last category venues and how they differ between the free and the premium service. Great. We're here. So now we've got to find some place for our, our event. Where are we going to have it? Do we want to have it at a McDonald's or like a nice steakhouse? Just like our organizers and our services customers, our venues get two specific options. They can list themselves as a free event. I think we might even have a McDonald's in here. We don't do a lot of parties at McDonald's, but you never know. We have a McDonald's that's very trendy here in town. But with that, they get a photo, they get a little bit about their, their organization, their name, their tagline, so easy to find. But more importantly, if we came in here and we wanted to find a pro version, you'd notice right away that the pro, like the organizer and the services, gives you a full gallery, videos, menus. You could even get pricing right out of here. The button takes you right to their website, social media. It's just absolutely amazing, the difference. And again, getting listed is quick, easy, less than three minutes for most people. And it takes you from depending on Google page ranks to instantly getting you in front of other organizers and event professionals just like you so that you can get found. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. This is just the experience of using the app. There's even more behind here and we're gonna get into that right now because understanding how the internet is changing, whether it be from social to recommendation to AI is where a pop event really takes you to the next level. Finally, with all of our listings. If you're a free user, you're listed instantly. And if you're a pro user, obviously you're listed also instantly and you get more information. But you also show up higher. You might be a restaurant that wants to be found first. All of our pro users, whether you're organizers, rest or venues, or service providers, you always show up first. Becoming a member is super simple. You just go to our join page and on our join page, we'll have information to help you find all you need to know about the different products and services, and it's as easy as filling out a form. You get the advanced directory services, some best practices, and no more technology to manage for your business. Whether you're an organizer trying to figure out how you can get more business into your world, or 
you are a service provider with different services. We know what it's like and the challenges that these different customers face. Finally, venues. It's, there's a lot of directories out there that will let you get listed, but they're not doing the absolute important work of the referral and recommendations that we're doing here at Papa Men. We know what it's like, we know your problems and our solutions here to address that. Once you've made that decision to try, try out for free. We have easy ways, whether you're an organizer, a service or a venue to get started right away. You click on these buttons, they take you to a super simple form that you can go ahead and fill out in that form, go ahead and get you started. I already started mine, so if you get started and you forget, it'll save where you are. But if you wanna start over, not a problem. You come in and say, start over. Our form engine won't get you started. We have a great checklist to tell you what you need before you get started, because you wanna make sure you have everything ready, and then walk through that form. Super simple. You might have never marketed yourself. You might have never marketed yourself on a directory. We give you the tips and clues as you go through this to make that decision. What's really wonderful is we show you right away the difference between pro and free and give you a chance to upgrade. If you don't want to upgrade, say later, say maybe later. We walk you through that you verify everything and then you're on the system that easy. Or you can jump right to it and say, actually, I like this. I want to try out a pro event. Our pro events, our pro services start at $100 a year for organizers. That's cheaper than a website. $200 a year if you're a service professional, AV, or for me, a speaker or catering, that's nothing to get found. And then finally, venues. Venues are $250 a year to get your venue in front of places. But this, like I said, is just the tip of the iceberg in getting set up. Because what sets pop event apart is really two things. It's bridging the traditional recommendations and trust engines that are all over the internet with new advanced AI. So let's look at those two features now. Once you're a member of pop event, things get really exciting because not only are you listed and can be found by other organizers or venues or service providers all over the internet, but you become part of our recommendation and AI engine. What does that even mean? Let me log in and show you. I'm gonna go up here to the corner and click on members and it's gonna take me to my exclusive login. I can log in with a magic link, no passwords to remember at pop event, or I can log in with my password. I'm gonna go ahead and log in now with my password and sign in. Instantly, when you log in, the first place it takes you to is your profile page. The last thing you wanna do when you're signed up for a service is have a complete email and support department to work with to manage your listing. We allow you to manage your listing directory. So when your services change or your tagline changes or you're doing events in a different part of the country, you can update that quickly. New keynote customer, add their logo right away to your profile page. But more importantly, you'll notice at the top of our website, once you're logged in as a member and you're an organizer, you have this new thing called Organizer Pro. What's Organizer Pro? Organizer Pro gives you access to something every single organizer needs right away. Imagine if you could see what all of your friends who are other organizers or all the places that other organizers have worked or providers they've worked with and understand what they liked and what they didn't. Because now when you're logged in and you go to one of our services or venues or professionals, you can actually click on them, see all the same information we saw before, but you also get reviews. Reviews, what is that all about? This is what's great about this. Part of the pop event professional network for organizers allows you to come in and review any other service provider or venue that you've actually worked with. These reviews are essential and critical to building trust and letting credibility. Our members recommend each other. Think of it as an exclusive club for organizers who only want to work with the best other service providers and venues. These reviews become the backbone of how we can search within the directory behind in our membership. Whether you're a free user or a pro user, the searching by references is available to you. This is really fun, uh, monumental when you think about it. So if I wanted to see the reviews behind a speaker or maybe the reviews behind one of the venues, did they deliver on time? Did they change their pricing at the end? All of this is available to you and leaving reviews is super simple. But the world is full of a lot of new cutting edge technology and just being found in a directory or being able to leave a review and search reviews by other people like you that you trust isn't enough today. And that's where a pop event AI goes the extra level. What is pop event AI? 
Let me show you that With right Pop now. With Event AI, we wanted to take the best of AI based on our years of working with our clients and other organizers and digitize it. It can be overwhelming to think about all the different ways AI can work for you and your business. So what we've done is we've made it simple. You can go to our, uh, our AI support button right on the member page once you log in next to your review and click on that. Clicking on that will take you to a brand new page you'll see introducing an organizer's best friend. Now, I, I agree, we are all best friends to each other, but what if we had a friend up in the cloud that could help us? What we've done is we've created a system where we can put our best practices in the cloud so that other event organizers can find them. So we've got a quick and easy form. You can come in here and say, I'm having a, a sales kickoff. I have about 200 people. I need something that's kind of funky, and I have a budget of $10,000. And I'll go ahead and ask it a question. Um, can you find me a witchy vibe, a witchy vibe in Salem, Mass, and recommend some activities for my event? And I'll say a witchy vibe venue because we actually need to meet someplace and have drinks and maybe cast a little spells. I'm going to go ahead and submit that. Right now, that information will go to our AI that's powered behind our users and our years of past knowledge of doing events and look for all the criteria that you put into the system as well as anything you might have typed. This service is available to all of our users and who are logged in. And what it does is gives you a hands-on quick representation of the power of not just our directory and our recommendations and our network of people who are just so excited to work, whether it be service providers or venues, but gives us you the ability to find and get answers quickly and easily without having to pay for an AI account or think about how it recommends your business because it's by organizers for organizers. Within moments, when you go to your inbox, you'll see you'll get an email and that email will be from the system. As you can see here, I've got an email that says, certainly Salem, Massachusetts is a great location for witchy events. For some venues, try these three things. For some activities, do these things. Given your budget, it should be no problem to even bring in some live entertainment or a tarot reader. So as you can see, Pop Event AI really changes how we think about finding our partners, recommending them, planning our events, and so much more. But the AI support just doesn't stop there with events and uh, services. We could do more. So let's come in here and try something else. I'm going to say I have a corporate event with about two to 500 people. It's super professional. I've got a budget of about $25,000. And plan a morning agenda for an auto event for dealership execs. That And you don't have to worry about your spelling. That includes maybe an icebreaker. So I just need a, a general I, a general kind of agenda to get things going. Um, and maybe starting at 9 a.m. with lunch by 1.30 p.m. We'll go ahead and submit. Again, it's gonna ask me for my email because it needs to know where to send this answer to. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in here. What I love about this is it allows us to take all the knowledge of our users and all the information we've trained the AI on and really zero down to help us get a leg up. A lot of times you don't want to recreate the wheel and just copying and pasting the same event templates over and over again without considering the mood, the vibe, or even the feeling or the focus of an event can be overwhelming. What's going to happen next is it's going to go ahead and take that information, send it up to the cloud, and then within moments, you should get that information back in your email. Let's go ahead and check our email now. All right, we're going to go over here and click on our email tab, and sure enough, there's another email from AI. Great, here's another suggested morning agenda for an event for auto dealership executives. 8.30 to 9 a.m., guests arrive and registration. Notice we said start at 9, so it built in the time for the registration. 9 to 9.15 all the way out to when lunch starts. So as you can see, not only is using Pop Event for, if you're like me, a service provider for $100 a year, or an organizer for $100 a year, or for me as a service provider, $200 a year, 
absolutely revolutionary because I'm getting myself in front of thousands of other organizers. I'm getting my business searched, found, and recommended on, but I'm also getting the ability to leave reviews and more importantly, create a shortcut to my work. I can't wait to have you try Pop Event and see all the amazing services we've baked into this product. This is just the start. Pop Event is for organizers, by organizers, but soon it's gonna be for you and by you. I can't wait to have you here at Pop Event. Thank you so much. <laughs>